Okay, this is going to be a short tutorial on how to add metadata to prints. So I've got two five by sevens on the page here to start us out, and I'm going to just open the full page editor by clicking there. And you can see that the top print is selected here by default. Um, now, now the bottom one's selected, but I can select both of them by hitting the control key and just selecting both. Um, so now they're both selected and on the layout tab here is add floating text and because that's a layout feature it's on the layout tab if you don't see it you're probably on the cropping tab so just click on the layout tab and then click add floating text and then it tells me to select the location so i'll select just click in here and i had some text in there before so i'll just back over that um, and I'll change the color to yellow, give us something better there. And you can find the metadata under this advanced tab. So click here and it'll open up this tab. You've got IPTC on the right. These prints don't have any IPTC data. So I'm just going to click on focal length. Uh, I'll stick with the EXIF data for this demonstration. Now up here you can see it added the code when I clicked on it. So I'm going to press enter so it gives me a new line and then click on aperture, press enter again, new line and shutter. So you can see what it looks like on the left here. Um, now you can't drag this yet because you're not done, but if you click on OK, then then you can drag your labels. Uh, copy changes to all labels, yes. So when I drag it, it wants to know, do you want to drag, drag it the same way for the other print that that same label is on? So if I put it right in the corner where I want it here, then it'll ask me if I want to, you know, copy the changes to this one. And I say yes. And it goes in the same spot here. Um, so basically that, that's how you can add the metadata. Now I can also right click here and edit. Uh, like if I don't like this 8.0, if I want an F in front of it, I can just go to the second line and put an F there. Um, so you can format this any way you want. I mean, I could do comma, space, hit delete, uh, comma, space. I could put it all on one line if I wanted to. And again, if you click here to open this advanced panel, you can see and click on these features. Um, and again, yeah, I'll copy it to the other one. And now you see it, it copied it down there too. Now when I move this, it's really slick because when I move it, I'll say yes, do it to all labels, and it moves it on the bottom one too. So because this one's a little longer, I might want to move it over just a little more. Yes, and now that looks nice. So hopefully this will get you started on how to add metadata to prints. Um, it has to do with what prints are selected and then you can add floating text and when the floating text opens up if we add a second label you can see that there's this option too: link to focus print selected print all prints on the page and so on so you can uh, do it that way i can link it only to the focus print and you'll see that this one goes away and the one that's in focus the one that's blinking is the only one that's going to get this new label that i have and maybe i want to put uh, well, let's see, uh, camera. So I'll put the camera model up there. So that's how you do it. I just canceled that to get rid of it. But as you can see, uh, now we have these labels. They don't have to be on the print. You can move them anywhere. As long as they're linked to the print, they'll move with the print, but they don't necessarily have to be on the print. Uh, as an example, I could move it. This is not going to show up very well because it's a yellow text, but you know, I could move it off the print and say yes. Right click to edit it and, you know, choose a new color like black. And then when I click OK, yes, copy it to all the labels. And now I've got it under the print instead of on it. So hopefully this will cover most of what you need to do for metadata on prints. Thanks for watching.